Here are the dangers of self-diagnosing on the internet. One, you are not a doctor. If it's one thing that really hindered my health anxiety recovery is the fact that I genuinely felt like I knew more than doctors and I felt like my judgment was better than theirs. But what we have to understand is that we have not had their training and we're coming from a biased, panicked point of view. So we will not be able to think logically. Number two, not everything you see on the internet is accurate or factual. Lots of information on the internet can be very, very outdated and you don't know what it is that you're reading exactly. And this can obviously make you feel a million times worse and you end up being entirely convinced that there's something seriously wrong with you. Three, you are looking for dangers. The amygdala, the part of your brain that looks for threats, will find it when you Google your symptoms. So you will go on there and your brain will look for the worst thing that it can find. And you'll then start to identify with it. You'll start reading stories. You'll start reading the symptoms and you'll feel like you have this whole bunch of evidence. You may even start manifesting and somaticizing the symptoms as well. You cannot, as a health anxiety sufferer, self-diagnose on the internet. Trust me, I've tried to do it and I've been wrong every single time. All it does is create so much more panic. Follow me for more.